Hello and welcome to my latest video. This is a Zenta and this is an EZ cap. Yes, an EZ cap. I'm British. It is an EZ cap. Not an EZ cap, an EZ cap. So it's USB. It's got a small input on the side which fits to this port. And on the end of this we have the video input. So S video and all the composite ports are used to. Plugs in just exactly like this. This comes off at 90 degrees to the USB bit. And of course, comes with a disc to put your drivers in. Here's the menu you get. You get the drivers, the VHS to DVD, and Blaze Video Magic. And we're not interested in any of the software, just the drivers, which is software, but none of the video software. We're going to come to that in a minute. So plug it in after installing your drivers. And now we're going to get this program. It's called AMCAP. I'll put the link in the description if you want to download it. But it does seem to be the best thing to use for your EZ cap. So here's a quick test. I've plugged my old camera into this. As you can see, we've got the video playing on the camera and on the computer at exactly the same time using a composite input. So it's the same as your gaming console. You can see absolutely no lag, playing exactly in sync. So here's your games consoles. We've got PS3, Wii, 360. They'll all connect with your EZ cap. Of course, you're going to have some few, few errors. One of these will be you'll need to put your device back from HD mode into AV mode. So to do this with the Wii, you turn it on. This is definitely connected, by the way. You can see there. Now turn your controller on. Wait for it to stop flashing. And when it's on one, hold down on the Wii remote and press reset. This resets your Wii's AV connection all the way back to normal. So it will use the red, white and yellow composite input. As you can see, it's on the screen. As soon as it's tuned in, it's ready to go. So of course, we've got on the Wii, we've got the option menu. I'm not sure why I clicked on it, but I wanted to show you the options menu. And you can see I'm controlling it with the classic controller, just to prove that it is my input. So here's the uh, inputs. You can see they're definitely connected to the Wii. I was thinking I might follow it around, maybe. No, okay. I'll do that for the PS3 in a minute then. But we've got, the, well, okay. I'm showing you it's connected to the Wii mode. Maybe that's useful. But we're about to switch to the PS3, so I'll show you everything then. And here is that PS3 I mentioned. To do an AV reset on the PS3, I'll just show you in a second. So I'm just following the AV cable round. It is definitely connected to my EZ cap. This is not a video. I'm not trying to trick you. Comes round here, down there, and plugs into the EZ cap. The EZ cap. And now we'll do that AV reset. So you put your finger on the power button. And you keep it there. Yes, it's not a button on this PS3, but on the other PS3s it is a button. Because we're going to try and avoid this red screen. But this red screen can also be triggered by another factor, that it's looking at the wrong input. Because obviously you've got the, uh, the normal yellow, uh, red and white for your input, but you also have the one which is many connections. And when you select the composite input, you get this, your PS3. Hoorah. So now I'm going to show you just how good this is. So I'm setting it up to record. We have the bottom right screen, which is the recorded content. But I've also set my camera up over my shoulder. It's exactly the same. As you can see, it records the sound as well. This is coming straight from the recording. There is no camera input. It's come straight from the uh, AMCAP software, which is amazing. And we're playing this uh, classic game. Maybe you'll recognize it. I don't know. It is pretty recognizable. I mean, look at that. It is recording in 4 to 3 format, in case you haven't noticed. That is uh, square screen, not widescreen. Uh, there probably is a way to fix this, but I didn't really look. Because I didn't realise it was recording in this. I was just there, I recorded both these. So I'm playing as Link, unlike in my Minecraft, well, like in my Minecraft series. But the controls are a tad more difficult. <laughs> Trying to remember them all and use them effectively it wasn't an easy task, come on. If you want to see the whole of this clip, I will upload it to my second channel called Mr. Tingo Wingo. I'll put a link to that in the description as well, as well as the EZ Cap product. So, everything you want, if you want the link, it'll probably be in the description. Go there to find it. This is part way through of my Legend of Zelda playthrough. I haven't been 
broadcasting it, so it's just The Legend of Zelda playing through, but I've been playing in my spare time. But, you can see it records from the Wii. What about the PS3? Surely that's no different. So a bit of Modern Warfare 2, and recording. So it's Modern Warfare 2, not 3, unfortunately. I'm going to go for Spec Ops, and Solo Play. Now, I haven't played Call of Duty in 8 months, so I'm just going to go on to any random one. I'm keeping it on regular because I'm lazy. And I want to at least look semi-decent. But again, we've got the PS3 on the bottom right and the recording from my camera on the top left. Bear in mind I'm recording on an LED screen so it might look slightly different to my recording. Now you can see here I'm just putting it into full screen. Again, this is when I realised it was in 4 to 3. I didn't realise initially. So, for those of you not familiar with the Call of Duty series, where have you been? Essentially, kill the terrorists. You're in some sort of uh, village of some description. And I'm not doing a very good job here. I'm sure you can find better videos of playthroughs on Call of Duty. I'm just proving to you that the EZ cap works. And again, if you want to see the video in full, I will upload it to Mr. Tingwinger. Now, I don't know why the sound was that was there, but it was on my game as well. So, yeah, whatever. Modern Warfare 2 bug, not me. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.